This is a block foundation. Now, cinder blocks are laid end to end. The center part of a cinder block is hollow. There's hollow cores inside of the block. And then when you get to the end, each block has ears on them, on the inside and on the outside. And when you put two blocks together, the ears match up and they actually make another core. And these cores will line up up and down the wall, creating like a hollow cylinder inside of the wall. So when water absorbs from your backfill area into the wall, it only has to go about an inch and a quarter, inch and a half, till it hits that hollow core and fills up inside of the block. And that's a problem. The way we address it is we tap what we call weep holes into the block, into those hollow cores, and we'll even do it where the mortar joints are because that's where another core is also, and allow it to drain. Then we put our drain board up, leave the weep holes open. Any water that ever could absorb in, it'll go through the weep holes and down into our drainage system. If you look, we've drained and we've tapped into each one of the cores of the block and allow that block to drain. 